This last hunt that I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be up in a double ladder stand and I'll be all by myself. Uh, it's about an hour and a half before dark and I'm getting settled in. I'm putting the Helion, the Pulsar Helion up on a tree arm and uh, I've also got the Pulsar Trail rifle scope on the Dragonfly. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to wait for darkness. Uh, the wind again is giving me fits and I've got to knock my scent down with the scent killer. And as I wait for darkness, it's quiet in the woods and all of a sudden night sounds start. And I love night sounds. And it's fixing to happen. I was absolutely covered up with hogs and literally I had trouble trying to make up my mind which one I was going to take. I'd settled the crosshairs on one and think, ah, no, and then I'd put them on another. And keep in mind, it is pitch black dark and the hogs have no idea that I'm in the tree. It was about an hour that passed by and this boar shows up and I'm telling you, He's a lot bigger than he looks when we ground check him here in a minute. see blood with the helion. Look at the blood right here. Holy smokes, there is blood everywhere. Oh my gosh, there's blood all over here. One of the big benefits of using a the thermal at night is not just the fact that you can hunt with it, but after you knock an animal down, it is so easy to use the thermal to be able to locate the animal when it's on the ground. Think about it, it's black dark, you're looking for little specks of blood on the ground. Normally, well, not with a the thermal, you just scan the area when you see them, they pop. When you're hunting and you're using thermal imaging equipment, you're gonna go out at nighttime and you're gonna be able to get them when the big boys come out. I mean, look at this. That's a great big old boar hog right there. And uh, he came out for an evening stroll. Little did he know that this was gonna be his last evening to wreak havoc out here. All right, folks, if y'all want more information on coming out here just north of Houston, Texas, to ground zero for what could be the best hog hunting in the United States. You can contact Billy Reeve with Hog Wild Adventures and he'll be happy to hook you up. As far as uh, equipment goes, you don't need to have the thermal to come out here and be successful. I mean, Billy's got a lot of opportunities. They primarily take bow hunters, but uh, if you have an air gun, you want to air it out. Uh, you want to come out here and you want to experience some of the best hog hunting in the world you need to get a hold of Hog Wild Adventures, Billy Reeves. I've been coming here for years and you're gonna absolutely love it.